beer museum and baseball. Can it get any better? We've decided to take the free 99 tour because we're... So you can't come to a uh, baseball match and not get a hot dog. This place is basically a museum of buildings. Cheers. Good morning everybody. It is currently 9.09 .09 in the morning. We're heading to Architectural Museum, the Sapporo Beer Museum, and then a baseball match today. So look forward to that. And I also want to show you, I was looking around the hotel room. That's actually that clock tower we went to yesterday in full on snow. We've got a little bit of history and, and that in the actual hotel, which is nice to see. We're heading to find John. He's probably located at Starbucks. And in the hotel they even have, guess what these are? Give up. Umbrella parking, park your umbrella in there and then lock it so no one takes it. Japan's so smart. Found him straight away. <laughs> Sticks out like a sore thumb. Got a caffeine hit from Starbucks. So behind us, that white building that has ESTA on it, it's like an electronics store, just gonna have a quick look. And then if you see behind, up there is the, one of the viewing platforms we went to on the first night we were here. This place is like a sensory overload for like advertisement, things like talking to you. Signage, just very overwhelming. There's just a lot happening. Everything's making noise. Everything's gonna get your attention. Displays are perfect in the shop. Like, just listen to the noises. So loud! Sadly, you won't fit in my hand luggage, mate, or I would bring you home in a heartbeat. Just sorting out our tickets for the Architectural Museum, which is the furthest on this line that we're taking. And then on the way back, we're gonna go to the Sapporo Beer Museum and then to the baseball match. All fair information will be displayed in English. Sleep. He's sleeping in there. Yeah. Guy's like got a fare and he's like fast asleep. My taxi driver is watching TV while driving. Legitimately watching TV. We've arrived at Kataku no Mora. Also known as the historic village of Hokkaido. So it's basically a architectural museum. <laughs> Bangers. Hello and this is snack of the day. We have here what looks to be a pretzel styled snack. These pretzels are making me thirsty. Not 100% sure because I can't read it. Let's have a taste. What are they, do you reckon? Very nice. I actually think it's, um, tastes a bit like pepper teriyaki, but a bit milder. If anybody can identify what these are, let us know in the comments. I'd give it a 3.5. I'd definitely get them again, and they only cost about 180 yen, so... Cool. Snack of the day is a semi-success. <laughs> <laughs> so, 800 yen. This place is basically a museum of buildings. So, what me and John are going to do is we're going to pick three buildings each to go into. Only because this place is, like, pretty big. It's the historical village of Kaido. So, we're going to pick three buildings each, and we're going to go through them, starting with John's pick number one. So, John's pick is a junior high school, built in 1905, and it's from the area of Sapporo, and they moved it out to this museum. My choice, I picked uh, an American barn, which was built by the Ogawa Family Dairy Barn. 
which was built in the 1920s and the plans were received from the USA. It's in US inspired basically. I picked it because it got a blue roof. Look at the, like, everything's like chipped, chipped away. This is my second pick, the Higuchi family farmhouse. Built in 1897 and inhabited until 1970. It was engaged in rice farming. The house originally stood at Abutsu, Shirohoshi village in Sapporo County. Look at those beams and the roof there, they're massive. And we're just walking through the architectural museum and we just come across this, a wicked suspension bridge. So we found my second choice. It is Kai Rolls Photo Studio, built in 1922, and it's a Western style with Japanese interior. Good pick, Dale. Looks good. Traditional Japanese interior. Traditional sliding doors. Here's our room. Whom are you supposed to slide those doors open? I don't have time for that. Oh man, these stairs are so steep. Like, look at that, it's like, woof, drops right off. There's like a big light wall. John's final pick. This is the Sapporo Agricultural College Hostel. This building was restored as part of a Sapporo Agricultural Hostel built in 1903. This hostel was named Kaiteki Ryu in 1907 and various student activities at the hostel were very popular among the citizens of Sapporo. So this is a picture of the hostel before it got renovated and removed and put into this current location. They've done a really good job of fixing it up. So my third and final pick is this building, which we thought was a bank, but it's actually a newspaper company built in 1909, printed for about 50 years. And they would have transported this all brick by brick, no doubt. Printing machines, this is cool. I'm glad I picked where, where we ended up because we got free postcards. We got all the little like kanji stamp kanji, things. Kanji. This thing here looks like it's out of Lord of the Rings. Look at all the bikes. Bikes, bikes, bikes. So we've arrived at Sapporo Beer Museum. How cool are those like gardens outside the museum? We've decided to take the free 99 tour because we're... The other tour is how much? 500 yen. 500 yen, so $5 and you get to go to some special areas and you get to try some beer that you can only try on the tour. But we don't want to wait till four o'clock because we've got a baseball match to catch. We've got places to be. We're allowed to take photos. No videos, but they don't know that. So let's start the tour. First room you go in is one of the distilleries, I think. Look at the size of this thing. So we wind down the uh, into the main room. This is like a timeline of the logo changing. So we just got our beers. We got a sample pack, which includes three beers, Black Label, Classic, and... Kaita Kushi. That was 600 yen. And then we both got an apple juice and... Green tea. We also got some nuts and cheese. So what's that? 800 yen all up. We're gonna try the beer and we'll get back to you. Cheers. Cheers. It's not too bad. It doesn't have a bitter aftertaste that beer usually does. I prefer the classic, black label, and then the, um, the one with the long word. The apple juice is really, really good. We love Japan. We're now on the way to the baseball. Be interesting to see what a Japanese baseball match looks like. See what the crowd's like. It's gonna be really cool. There is the Sapporo Dome. This thing is huge. There's like no windows in it. It's just a one big silver dome. I don't even know what the teams are that we're seeing. We're literally going in blind. Uniform 
ファイターズを応援してください。So we are at a baseball match. We are watching the fighters versus the buffalo. I do believe.、Uh, what do you reckon you're so far of the match, John? The match is good so far. The buffaloes are winning, but the fighters are putting up a good fight. It's currently the Beginning of the fifth round, the fighters pitching. It's very interesting. There's cheerleaders and like chanting. If you come to Japan, go to a baseball match. It、yeah. is very good. Definitely, professionalism is top notch. Skills, skills. It's just a lot of fun. World class. Don't have to go to America to see a baseball match. You can do it in Japan as well. So you can't come to a、uh, baseball match and not get a hot dog. It's very tasty. Mystery meat. Tastes good. There's these like I'm calling them keg girls. One's walking past now, and they're carrying like a fair bit of weight on their back, and they've got like cup dispensers and beer on their back, and yeah, it's like a keg of beer strapped to their back, and they're selling it in the game. Keg girl. So we're in the last innings. The fighters, the home team, have one home run, and the Buffaloes have got two. And this is the last inning, so they need two runs to win. Two plus two is four. Minus one, that's three. Quick maths. Because I know what I'm talking about. <laughs> and the home team couldn't get a run. The Buffaloes win. What do you reckon, John? Good game. Baseball game in Japan. Enjoyed that. It was very good. Dancing girls, the food, the atmosphere, the game. If this was a stadium in Australia, people would have thrown the rubbish on the seats everywhere. In Japan, they separate it into like 16 different bins and all give a shit. So the architectural museum. Was amazing. The Sapporo Beer Museum was also amazing, and the baseball match was very good. Hope you guys enjoyed. If you got any comments or questions about Japan, leave them in the comment section down below. Hit the like button so more people can enjoy these videos, and I'll catch you in tomorrow's video. Hello Kitty Barriers, only in Japan. So down on the bedside table, there is a. What do you think it is? It's a flashlight.